this is what the frame looks like on when we take the box part off. See how that's the frame? Yeah, that's and that's screwed into the my skull. Yeah, that's correct. Just like you see. Uh, right is there. that gonna? Okay, I mean, hell, that's what I guess I got to do to, to, to survive this. But that hurts, right? Well, like I said, he injects the local anesthetic to numb it up. You'll feel a lot of pressure when he's putting it on, but it shouldn't be sharp and painful. But see, this box is what stays on for the MRI. Right. And then this box part comes off. But this part would be... So these are the four screws for my head? That's yeah. where they would go. Yes, they go right through there. And it's screwed in for 30 minutes? No, this will stay on for the entire But it stays numb. Treatment. I mean, but it's you won't, like you they won't numb it all the time. Once yeah. it's on, you it's don't very, need to pick it up, you know. It's very around. similar to a halo. Have you ever seen anybody with a broken neck? It yeah. Wears a, okay, they wear them for months. Right. Yeah. yeah, it's not painful once it's on. Okay. It's not even... Real, Real painful going on. It's uncomfortable. There's, all right. And I'm uh, awake for all of this. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's nothing like the pain you're having. Nothing like and, the pain. I'm, say that one more time. It's nothing like your pain that you're having. You see this I gentleman? Can it, then I can handle it. You see this gentleman? Can you tell he's smiling? Let me see. He is smiling. Yeah. What the hell is wrong with this guy? <laughs> <laughs> it's not bad once it's on. For a few minutes, it's uncomfortable. Most uncomfortable part of it is getting it numb because there's a quick needle stick. Right. The medication, which is a mixture of lidocaine and all, burns and stings. Most people kind of give us a yeah. response. Okay. Then there's a lot of pressure when he's tightening it down. Then once it's on, people almost forget they have it on. It's not uncomfortable. So it's nothing like losing two legs. Uh, yeah. No. Piece of cake. That's all I needed to hear. Yeah, piece of cake. Okay. You know, um, but it will be on you. Let me put this part on one more time. Right. Do me a favor and take your mask off for a minute. Okay. All right, just look straight ahead. I just want to see where this lands. Yeah, because it was tearing that right ear up before. Well, the box will be on it, but I'm worried about what how it'll stay. That. Hey, y'all smell good. No, that would be a, Does it have to be that low? I don't know exactly what we're talking about. No, it's okay, because I got a thing back here. This might not need to be quite that. Which one is it? Oxypharyngeal. But there's still not. My main thing is forward and back. And the higher you up, higher up it is, the less room you have. <laughs> Unless I flip it over and we don't go low. Yeah, it's a lot lower than the question. So, you know, they say I'm kind of wide, to too wide to fit into the machine. To Shoulder and chest wise, I'm too wide. So I'm going to have to compress myself on the day of the radio surgery to fit into the coffin casket like apparatus. Can y'all tell I've been crying? Yeah. Shit kind of hit me now. So, it is what it is. I gotta do what I gotta do to survive. That's the helmet there, y'all. It's a very tight one, because I got a big head, they said. They said I got a big head, like Jeremiah. We had the gamma knife surgery center here in Columbia, South Carolina. And um, I'm feeling kind of optimistic. I got to get this done. So I can try to be normal again. And they said it doesn't take, like, it takes a while. Like, it's not going to be no quick fix, they said. Y'all say it's not going to be no quick fix, right? No. When you leave here that day, you would be pretty much the same. You say yeah. the average to fill any... I don't think you're going to find one laying around because we used to have an extra one somewhere. Maybe, yeah. Oh, look in the... We took all of them out of the trays, didn't we? I don't know if we took all of them. I was just going to flip it over.
over and see if that bought us anything. I know I had an excellent. I didn't want to. Yeah, my knife treat me wrong. My dear Deborah has comforted me now, and I ain't scared no more. So we're gonna make. And what's your name, dear? Andrea. De uh, Deborah and Andrea. All right, we got Deborah from the Bible, and uh, you know we got Andrea from. Where are you from, Columbia? <laughs> Not really. Well, we and we've been doing this since 1998. Wow. Since we 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 opened this joint. So was <laughs> I like that? So what, it was Dr. Worthington that that started this here. But he was one of the physicians. Yes, we had two physicians that started it up, and Dr. Worthington was one, and Dr. Clark was the other. One. Okay. But yes, Dr. Worthington's been doing it from the beginning of time, along with me and Andrea. Dr. Clark still, um, yeah, he said y'all were great girls. That's what Dr. he said. Dr. Clark retired a while, but Ray oh. was, he didn't do it that long. Yeah, yeah. He, he only did it for a year or so, and then he retired. Oh, okay. We've retired several doctors. Hey, listen, hey, this must be expensive, I can tell you that. Hey, y'all <laughs> listening, I'm go fund me. Y'all help me out. Medicare? I ain't got nothing. No, oh, wait a minute. Yes, I do. You have yes, I do. Hold on. I got something here. Right. I just signed up for something. I can't remember what it is. Take the glasses off one more time. All right. And we'll put this over and let's see how low we can get it if it pulls up. Let's see how low can we go. Tightening and pulling. I sure hope you like leave it to be I sure hope I didn't piss you off with that one. I didn't think of that. J June Cleaver. Oh. The haircut. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's pretty hairy. Yeah, that's the color I was going for. But it came out. Well, I can't I get it. Missed. I can't get it. Oh, yeah, I missed. Big miss. Came out platinum blonde. Okay. Well. Okay. I don't have enough wisdom yet. That's all. I was going to say, mm. you're, you're not, you were trying to fake it. Yeah, exactly. See? Exactly. You have to be natural. You got to earn that. That's right. That's right. You got to earn everyone. That's what my mama told me. You sound just like my mama. She said the same exact words. Let me give y'all my new insurance card. Now, you know, the only thing we can say, we can let Dr. Worthington know that we can get this on there. It's going to be a tight fit. And I could I could probably squinch my compress myself out. Oh, that's not it. Well, the only thing is like you have to lay you got to lay back and, and too, and you can't. You know, I think if you're doing this, it might. We're doing it there, but I mean that would where you can't really. Let me see. What? How about now? Well, yeah, you can. Do that, but I'm just not sure. Don't do it quite I, that much. Yeah. Oh, okay. I want to make sure. What are they telling you? 24, which there we can do it.
Okay, so you would tell him. Oh, sorry. We'll right. tell him that it, we can get the frame on him. So can you can you let me feel right now where they screw it in at the points that they screw it sure, in? Let me put the box on and it'll All right. hang a little better. Right. I know I've read some great things about y'all here. I know that. Well, that's good to know. Because I was going to go to the Mayo Clinic. Uh -huh. And then they told me the pricing structure. And I said, well, <laughs> I don't think I'm built for that Mayo Clinic pricing structure. Was that an air bladder you just put mm -hmm. out? Just okay. to help the position. Okay. So it'd be just about like that. We might lower these a little bit. Right. So you, he'd put a mark about right there. Mm -hmm. About right there. Mm -hmm. About right there. Okay. And right there. So that's the four screws. Mm -hmm. So right. we clean those off there. And he would inject. So let me ask you this. I would have to keep my eyes closed then, right? No. Well, the way, oh, it's not, it's not positioned the way it's going to be now, but it was pushing my left eye closed. But it won't be like that that day, right? Well, it would be pretty close there. Now, we'll, you know, tight. you let us know and we can try to shove. You don't have a lot of maneuverability. Yeah, you no. know, your head. So you're trying to say I got a big head. That's, well, all, that's all I heard. You're not the first well, time you that, right? <laughs> but see, your head compared to mine. Thank you, dear. See, compared to mine, see, we have a lot, I have a yeah, lot Yeah, so you got a cute little a peach head, face. see, yeah. I have a pea head. Oh, pea head, I said peach. <laughs> okay. okay, I have a lot of space yeah, to you maneuver do. around. Yeah, you do, But yours, you filling it up. You, you fill it up, so we don't have a lot. If she tells me I got a big head one more time, I might cry. <laughs> oh, well, I But it ain't the first time I've been told that, you I, correct me. I'm sure you wear a large hat, right? Oh, that's true, that's true. Extra large, large hat, yeah. Um, I'm actually a seven and seven and a half. That's the size men's hats, you know, for doors. Yeah, but they come out extra, extra large and regular size. Yeah. Okay. So what we would say is, as far as we can tell, on what makeshift we're doing right now mm -hmm. is we should be able to get the frame on you. Okay. It's going to be a tight fit up in the machine, but I, you know, it's going to hopefully be, it's you going to be should successful. be able to fit. It's going to be successful. Okay. Yes, ma'am. There's always the chance, and you have to understand, that we put the frame on you, mm -hmm. and get you up there, mm -hmm. but when we get you up there, we have to be able to get you down low enough that this sits in a holder perfectly level. We even take a level and level it. Mm. If for some reason, because of the, the size of your shoulders and all, we can't get you leveled out mm -hmm. and in there, then we would have to say, we, we, can't, we can't finish it, we can't get it done. So you may have had the frame put on and still not be able to be treated. We hope not, but that's not our plan, and that's why we wanted you to come and let us test, test it. it. That yeah. decreases the likelihood that that would happen, but it's always still it's just not a hundred percent guarantee till we really go through all the you know, steps. or that you could even get in and we could get the frame done, and then when they're looking at it on the treatment planning, that they can't visualize <laughs> that nerve well enough to be able to target it. If we can't see the nerve well enough to know that's the exact spot we need to treat, then the same thing would happen. They would say, 
because we're not going to just apply radiation. Yeah, you have really to know what you, you have to have a target. And say, right? oh, we think it's about there. We're going to shoot some radiation. I so appreciate it that. <laughs> yeah. that's, that's comforting. That is not yes. what you want to do. So, you know, there's always that possibility that we go through different steps and still call it off and say, you know, can't be treated. We can. You want to test fit me in there? Well, we wish we could test you in the MRI, but we can't. But they're slammed. You were telling me that... Uh, Thank you for your identity has been verified. Oh, wow, they do eye verification? Oh, uh, you know what? I forgot what John Bolt is. Wait, they, they verify you by your eye... That is very secure. So this does the, about the eyes? Iris. Uh, Iris. Iris, yeah, that's uh, that's the high-tech federal uh, bank type stuff. Sorry, we cannot confirm. She's not legit either. <laughs> uh-oh, who, oh, God, who's this been fitting me? That's interesting. Sorry, we cannot confirm. It's probably. But even though I verified That's crazy. So, so there's no way to override that, then, I guess. No. Like, no code you could put in, I mean. No. Nice. If we told you that, we'd have to. Uh oh, don't, don't, please don't tell me. I do not want to know. That's nice. I wonder if they got security systems like that for the house. I'm going to have to check that out. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yes ma'am. Watch this here now. I'm, I'm going to shock you. So this is the... the this is the treatment table. Treatment the table. The MRI's in the other part of the building. But, um, this is like, like a little more room than... Um, this one does. This has more room. Yeah, than yeah this is better than the MRI here. I can do um, this with no problem.
tired. <laughs> that big old head, huh? towards the head of the bed a little bit more for me. get where he thinks he needs to target that particular nerve. All right. Well, I think that's all we know. That's all we know how to <laughs> All right. Now you all going to study up on it. Mm -hmm. We're going to send information all right. to Dr. Worthington. Well, I sure appreciate you, young ladies. Oh, wait a minute. No, because normally, see, I'm a rule breaker, but see, with this, <gasps> what? You, I know you're surprised I shocked you. <laughs> well, I sure thank you, ladies. Now, you were saying, you never finished saying, um, when I asked you out there, I said, so this is not no quick fix, and then you started, but you were looking in the cabinet for something. You know, sorry, I, I, I'm sorry. I, know, I said, no, it isn't. Right. Remember, it's going to take, okay. yes, thank you, they man. say, on the average, six weeks. Mm-hmm. Sometimes it's three months, and 
you know, I, I would think it's going to take at least that long. Okay. To, to, get, some to, to get some relief, right? Because radiation, like I said earlier, just starts almost like a chain reaction in changing the makeup of the cells of that nerve so that it doesn't conduct pain. It's not laser, it doesn't change anything overnight. Mm -hmm. um, it's a process. The treatment is only one time, one day, okay. one time. Yeah. But the effects of that treatment occur over time. Okay. So it takes a little while. And everybody's different. You know, some people respond a little quicker than others, but um, I wouldn't want you to go out of here thinking, hey, I'm going to get rid of this plane in a couple of weeks because right. that's probably not going to happen. Mm, okay. Well, I sure appreciate you, there young are, ladies. That's why I was asking about other procedures you may have had done because other procedures that directly uh, manipulate the nerve or sometimes have effect quicker than radiation does. Balance does any of the medicine give you some relief? It, it knocks me out. Mm -hmm. So I guess if I guess it's not the word in the sense I did is if I'm sleeping, but that's not any way to live. Though. They still wake me up in my sleep. Mm -hmm. Out of my sleep, this these attacks. So. Mm -hmm. I don't even know how to ask that question. They make me sleep, I know that. Mm -hmm. So, hope. And uh, other than the medication, what else have you had done? With this, Any I had those shots in there. Shots in the C3, C3 and C4, so, or C2 and C3. Mm -hmm. They gave me these shots, laser guided. They were laser guided. I can't remember the medication, that they, the steroid that they gave me, though. Mm -hmm. And that did absolutely nothing. I think it aggravated it the last time. And I didn't go back. Because mm -hmm. I was having them one right behind the other after that. Okay. okay. So, well, I'm looking for some success here. Yeah. yeah. Well, it, it might be the ones to give it to. It, That's exactly. what I need. You sure would. Thank now, you. Um, so, we'll talk to him. And then I think, you know, for him to schedule it, he was wanting the neuroradiologist from his area. Right. Instead of having someone brand new right. that's never seen your scan and your nerves or what's ever been done before, he was going to have the guy that he routinely works with at Charleston who's going to try to uh, coordinate, coordinate mm -hmm. time so that he could come as well. Yeah. And so they'll be the ones that will be in contact with you as to when he's able to do it. All right. It's usually on a Wednesday, I can tell you that much. Mm -hmm. I just don't know which Wednesday. Okay. All right. Thank you, ma'am. I sure appreciate you're you, Miss Denver. You're welcome. You know that whatever day we treat you, you'll be here at 7 o'clock in the morning. Yeah, I know now. I will have, have to. You're here at 7 o'clock in the morning? I will have to. I have to probably spend a night in the hotel. Okay. A lot of people do that when they're coming from out of town. Yeah. You want to go out this door? I don't know. I can't even see the door. Where's the door? Where, well, it goes to the front there. Where's your family oh, waiting? Oh, um, how did I come? Outside? Who brought, who how brought did I, you? Who brought how you? How did I come in here? Yeah. Well, you came in here, but this is quicker. Who dropped you off?